Hi, I'm Connie Smith, and I think Hamilton has to sell itself to Hamiltonians before it can sell itself to anyone else. Do you remember when the World Road Cycling Championships came to this city? Remember those incredible, magnificent aerial images of our beautiful roadways and parkways and waterways? cascading and crisscrossing down the escarpment, flowing out to the harbor front, Coots Paradise, on through to Royal Botanical Gardens. Remember how they made us feel inside? It's not just knowing what we have here and seeing what we know is there. It's feeling what we have here. It's all about a sense of pride. You know, we've become very good at hiding our secrets here. We have, what, over 100 waterfalls, an incredible waterfront and shoreline, uh, an amazing brow. How many restaurants do we have taking advantage of those views? How many new developments are there making them people places with hustling, bustling business and, and thriving activity? We're really good at hiding the, the, the very wonders that make us as great as we really are. Part of the problem is anyone that takes a creative stand and wants to build some nice controlled housing on a waterfront or maybe on the mountain brow, they're faced with this huge multi-level political juggernaut that really becomes very daunting. And then on top of that, tax beyond what they should be. What we need is a multi-level, high-caliber media campaign showing those gorgeous images of our city, superimposed with people at work at play, thriving and being engaged in our community. We need to beam those images to television stations around the world, websites, transit systems, wherever there's a place where someone can look. And you'll be surprised at how many people will start noticing Hamilton, Ontario, Canada, because people want to be part of a good thing. You got to think great, to act great and be great, and most importantly, be perceived as a great place to be. Hamilton, are you up to the challenge?